<clears throat> we're probably going to be putting a few videos up tonight. Because i got a few different things to share with you. Uh, first one is, I really like this new stem. And as you'll see here, I couldn't hold out. Hmm? So I'm tired and sleepy. Can you tell? Look at me. I'm going to pass out in the middle of this pipe tobacco thing. Oh. Look. Somebody... We're like the red hat ladies. Somebody got their stem early. I did. That's her Christmas, one of her Christmas presents. Uh -huh. She got a little bit early for Sarge stem. Uh -huh. So, Sarge. Uh, we went into Strauss tonight to pick up a few things and we went in with our fancy stems and they really uh, they really they were digging them you mm-hmm so uh, I gave them your YouTube screen name um, they said they might uh, might be getting in touch with you about maybe getting some stems in their store because it they think that <clears throat> these would sell pretty well in their store they have they have people asking about replacement stems or whatever for the corn cobs and something like this uh they would sell pretty well so if you're looking for a retail outlet to <clears throat> put your stuff in might be a place to start other thing is, while we were there, <clears throat> they have a new backy. And we picked up uh, some of their tobaccos they have. If you buy two ounces, you get one free. This is an introductory tobacco. Uh, right now, it is buy two ounces and get one free. Check this out. Pipe weed. That's the phone number there for Strauss. You guys are interested in trying some of this. That's what I'm smoking. I got the pipe weed. She's got the hobbit's weed. And this stuff, um, now it's nothing like the hobbit's weed, but it is, uh, it is very fruity. It's got a very, uh, Kind of a tart fruit, almost like a cherry or apricot or like one of the green apples or something like that. It's quite good. And it's a very reasonable price for you buy two ounces, get one free. So you Lord of the Rings people out there, I'm gonna get you some pipe weed. They got it at Strauss. All right, moving onward. In our uh, holiday giveaway extravaganza, Skipsy's holiday giveaway uh, extravaganza. Thank God we're on the final. <laughs> well, one of the videos that we got an entry from was uh, one of the four green fellas, our buddy uh, Tim Ogden. Now, he is a uh, professional beer guy. He is a... I think he's what you call like a brew a master or something. Master? He's he's such a he's such a brew guy. He named his son Brewer. His son's named Brewer. Yeah. So his entry for the contest was uh, he said that for his holiday spirit, um, the one thing that he was really looking forward to was every year, um, this particular beer, Sierra Nevada puts out this celebration. He said he waits all year long to get this. So we went to the store tonight and uh, I was actually there, I went there to pick some of this up. So I'm enjoying tonight the Sierra Nevada celebration in my brand new pipe smoking Santa mug from, or pint glass from, all the way from Walmart. Um, Such an exotic place. Mm -hmm. The exotic bazaar known as Walmart. <laughs> Exotic for the wildlife and the natives, not the uh, not the array of merchandise necessarily. Sorry, blue collar piper. I knew you worked there. I'm just teasing. But you've seen the people who shop there. 
You should have seen what happened tonight with the lady trying to buy cigarettes. But that's another story altogether. So, where's the other stuff that you put on the floor behind us? Where'd you put that six pack on the floor? Ladies and gentlemen, it's right behind him and you can't find it. Mm. Here it is. All right. <clears throat> That's why you keep a boontar busy. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> so I went to pick up some of the, some of this stuff, the uh, celebration, and we saw some of this. <clears throat> and Sister Skipsy kind of paid attention to that. This uh, snowdrift vanilla porter, and thought that looked interesting, and we just kind of commented on it. And uh, the gentleman who was walking by recommended it. I yeah, the guy walking by, he says, "Oh yeah, that's good stuff. You should get it." He says, "It's a little bit, a little bit darker. It's a little, it's a little bit closer to a stout almost." Uh, we we kind of hemmed and hawed at it, but uh, I told him that we were there specifically to get this, and we told him, you know, that a very good friend of ours, who's like a beer expert, looks forward to this every year. So he actually, he was kind of. Uh, perusing around the aisle and not... He left with a six-pack of that, yeah. and we left with a six-pack of this. <laughs> yeah, he ended up getting some of this based on Tim's recommendation. And uh, and we ended up, we got a six-pack of this as well. So we got a couple of, couple of nice holiday brews to keep us busy, as well as I've been working on a 12-pack over there of the uh, Sam Adams um, mixed 12-pack here. Give me that bottle right there. This is one I had earlier, this uh, old Fezziwig Ale. And uh, last night I had a chocolate Bach. And they have a couple of other flavors as well. So we've been enjoying some Christmassy beers and some uh, Hobbit weed tobacco, pipe weed, and uh, our brand new stems from Sarge. So Beautiful, and I love them. Mm-hmm. Look at her face. Doesn't she look happy? Looking tired. <laughs> Alright guys, that's about it. Just wanted to share that with you. Uh, I'm go ahead and wrap this one up and we'll get on with the next video here in a minute. Be back in a minute. Be back in a minute. See ya.